Hi guys. You know, previous two weeks were very interesting for me because I made a lot of experiments and made huge changes to uh, my FX Impact M3. Great thanks to guys from FX. They sent me new 800 millimeters barrel, and I've uh, made several tests and decided to make to make some changes. First of all, it's installed with a barrel harmonics tuner, but that's not thing we will speak about today. Uh, and I found out that uh, you know it vibrated too much as for me at least uh, visually when I checked it visually and I decided to make a carbon fiber tube it's about 120 millimeters uh, that is tightly uh, put on the barrel and being fixed with a barrel shroud and now barrel is really really strong you can see that I can just rise my gun that is heavy really heavy and I have no any problems here so this question is solved closed and I have no any uh, doubts about it another part was uh, testing and upgrading uh, the armor and valve system I wanted to make uh, hammer weight and to make it more heavy uh, you know I'm just awful lathe man so I will not show you how I made it and how it looks like it's made of brass and it weights about 8.5 grams so it's about 2 grams heavier than original uh, hammer weight then I decided to get rid of uh, valve spring but first of all I had to understand will it hit the cap of uh, the valve spring or not and uh, I use slow motion disassemble the gun uh, and use slow motion to be able to see the path that it goes uh, when I make a shot uh, with the 165 bar after the second regulator and it was very interesting for me because I found out that it's just about four millimeters not more and then I understood that I can easily use it without any uh, hammer sp valve spring and I did it it allowed me to get some extra five meters per second with 40 grain projectile and now using this extra hammer weight uh, using a long barrel 800 millimeters using 165 bar uh, after the second drag I have got up to 300 meters per second with 40 grain slug I know that uh, my slugs I use uh, they are very good at uh, these velocities at least from barrels I get used to shoot with before and now it's time to make test with this long barrel mm. It's really thrilling and just I'm very interested in getting the results. Another thing I forgot to tell you about is that I've got this velocity on 13th uh, position of power wheel. That means that I have uh, three more to go. They don't give some extra speed for me, but they will obviously change the vibration of the system so I will check it and I will find it out so it'll be very interesting for me to shoot today and I hope that results will be interesting for you also unfortunately after 24th of uh, February we are not able here to get any parcels from abroad and uh, it makes my experiments uh, a bit more complicated so to say because I have to make some parts myself Anyway, show must go on and we will do it, we will continue shooting, we will continue our tests and I appreciate your support guys, thank you very much. Let's see what we have here.
Начинается. Чего? Yes. <laughs>